Here's a little advanced tip for you. If you've just been animating with keyframes, you might have noticed this. When you hit play on your animation, the camera here starts off slow, speeds up, and then slows down at the end. So now it's going top speed, and then it has a slow stop when it reaches that last keyframe. Some people like this because it adds a smoothness. Some people don't like this because whatever they're trying to film, they want it to just happen at one speed perfectly the whole time. Here's how you fix that. It's called easing, and it's not hard to fix. Let's just rewind, and here we go. We have to do this in a slightly different window. Uh, this is the first time we're changing windows here, but check this out. Down here, where it indicates it's the timeline window, we're going to switch this. Go from timeline window to graph editor. The graph editor is a fancy way. What it's doing here is, is we don't have to go into detail, but these are the keyframes that have been put in, and it's showing you how the Y position is changing, how it's easing to its destination point here. So it's a little chart of position. What I want to do here is I want to select all the points by hitting A. Okay, that just turned them off. So hit A again. All the points were selected. And I want to go key, interpolation mode, linear. The one you have on right now is Bezier. Okay, it curves it out and smooths it out. If we go linear, you're going to see the graph change in the background. Boom. Now it's a dead straight line. It's one solid speed the whole time. There's no easing. And that's really it. Once you've done that, you can go back to the timeline view. And when you play the animation now, you'll realize one constant speed right from the start. That's it. That's how you set the interpolation mode to linear on your keyframes. Thanks for watching.